So the reason I'm doing this video is because my son went on an interview with Pets at Home. Um, he is dark skinned and he has a Latin name and there were eight other candidates for the interview of which were all white English and they all had came in you know scruffy or just not tidy clothes hardly put any input to, into the teamwork and yet my son did all of that um, and he came to the interview completely dressed smartly he was praised for his input and everything and then he came in for a second day of trial which he did a fantastic job they told him that and then they proceeded to say he didn't have the job so I started to question is pets at home a racist company so I've put in here if you go to Google pets at home staff and you press images well have a look here for yourself if you look at all the images they're all white English staff not one black, one, not one Asian, not one Latino, nothing. All English staff. In fact, the only page that has any mixed race in it is their promotional website. So you can see there for yourself. You can check it for yourself. Go and have a look. I'm not making this up. These are real staff members in Pets at Home around the UK. And yes, they're all white English. Can you see any blacks or Asians? No, you can't. So there you go. So it just makes me question, is Pets at Home really a racist company? Because they only employ, by the looks of all their pictures on Google, white English candidates. And I'm not making this up, as you can see for yourself. You can check this for yourself and you can see these pictures for yourself in Google right around the world and I'm not making this up and it makes me question do they employ people because they are hard-working staff or is it just because they're white English please let me know your opinions if you have also noticed this in your area or you've been for a job and you're uh, not being offered a job with pets at home because you think of your colored skin all right then, thank you, bye.